Hello friends, this video on lines and angles part 9 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Let's start with the corresponding angles. So as I mentioned, there are two parallel lines. These two are corresponding angles. Okay. Or these two are corresponding angles. Okay. Or these two are corresponding angles. Or these two are corresponding angles. Right? So each of these pair is a corresponding angle. Correct? So there is no proof for this. Again, you can measure this with your uh, protector. So you'll see that these two angles, you draw two parallel lines, L and M, draw transversal, this is transversal. This is transversal. And then you'll see that these two angles are equal. Or if you want, they can draw in one shot. Let me name this L and M, where L is parallel to M. This angle is 1, this is 2, this is 3, this is 4, this is 5, this is 6, 7 and 8. Any naming convention you can give and using protector you can observe that angle 1 will be equal to angle 5, this one. Angle 2 will be equal to angle 6, this one. Angle 4 will be equal to angle 8, this one. Angle 3 will be equal to angle 7, this one. So this is using observation. Now since this is done using observation, there is no proof for this. So I'll write axiom. I'll not write theorem. Why? Because using observation I have proved this. So the axiom will be if uh, for corresponding angles, if a transversal intersects intersects two parallel lines and then each pair of please note they all corresponding angles corresponding angles is equal please note this is an axiom now okay and this is called corresponding angle axiom Okay, this is called corresponding angle axiom. Why axiom? Because this is not proved based on observation we have given this statement. Okay, and let's see the converse of this is true. This is axiom. Let's see the converse of the statement is true. First, let me write the converse. So if I write the converse using plain English, the converse will be If a transversal intersect two lines such that pair of corresponding angle is equal then two lines are parallel okay this is just a plain english converse it is true or false we don't know you'll see that it can be true it can be false we can prove that but so in this case we say that if a transversal intersects two parallel lines then the angles are uh, corresponding angles are equal in this case we say that if the corresponding angles are equal then the lines are parallel okay so now let's prove if this is true or not okay let's prove it first let's let me write the ones again axiom and converse so axiom says that if parallel then corresponding 
angles equal and this is we have seen observe it so converse is a corresponding angles equal then parallel right this is true or false we don't know we have to prove it so let's prove that so we have to prove that it is true okay so let's draw a line td and let's draw two point here let's mark it b and c and let this be a line ad and we'll draw two angles from these point uh, b and d such that they are equal it means if this angle and this angle such that these two angles are same we'll draw this and give some point name here q and s right so we have the line and we have these two points from these two points we do two angles and they are equal now if you see these two angles are nothing but corresponding angles in fact what we can do is we can, ex we can extend these lines so we are not saying that these lines are parallel and let me uh, give some value here and p and this br so we know that this angle is uh, angle 1 let's suppose this is angle 2 so we know that angle 1 is equal to angle 2 that is given right so we have to prove what pq is parallel to sr correct because by geometric construction we have made uh, created this line such a way that angle 1 is equal to angle 2 okay and these are corresponding angles okay so we have to prove that these are parallel okay so to prove this what we can do is again if you see this is all axiom so we have to use geometric construction so draw a perpendicular line from this point and if you touch here you will see that this angle is also 90 degree and measure the distance similarly at this point also some other point draw a perpendicular it goes down you see that it is also 90 degree and measure the distance you will see that distance of this line and this line is same you can do the same thing at other point for example extend this right from this point draw a perpendicular you see that this angle is also 90 degree and this line this, this are the same so the distance between this line pq and sr is same because you are measuring the length using uh, geometric compass sorry protractor and scale since you are measuring the length using scale you had seen that these three lengths are same it proves that pq is parallel to sr so it is all by geometric construction we have proof and since we know that if it was axiom and there was no proof for it similarly using geometry only we have proved it this is correct right since this is correct i can say that this is a converse axiom okay so for corresponding angle we have two axioms one axiom that if there are two parallel lines there is a transversal which creates if there, if there are two parallel lines there is a transversal which creates corresponding angle then these pair of corresponding angles are equal that is first axiom and the second axiom is that if a transversal intersects two lines such that the pair of the corresponding angles are equal then these two lines are parallel okay and please note since these are axioms we didn't uh, prove it uh, by using uh, any other axioms we have just proved this by observation by actually constructing it right so if you see the axiom itself we have proved by creating two parallel lines creating a or drawing a transversal and measuring these values here also what we did was to prove the axiom we created two uh, corresponding angles which are same and then we extended this line and we proved that these two lines are parallel that tool that also by using geometric construction and that's why it is axiom thank you visit our website examfear.com to watch more and more quality education videos you can also attempt free online tests that are there in our website you can also 
get access to tons of free study materials and you can also find free tutors and mentors in this website. Thanks a lot for watching.